Happy birthday, Hunter Brown turns 26 years old today. He's on the hill for the Astros, making his 26th start of the season. And in his last 14 starts, he is 10 and two for the Astros. The left-handed hitting Michael Massey will lead it off. And that's lined into right field for a base hit. So a leadoff base runner, Michael Massey on for Bobby Witt Jr. 2-1. And Witt hits it a mile high to left field. Over toward the line goes Gamble. Out is Pena as well. Gamble gets there, makes a two-handed grab, and that's out number one. Back to first base goes Massey. And Pasquantino lifts this one. Third base side foul ground. Bregman racing over onto the warning track. Stops, makes the catch a step shy of the Royals' dugout railing for the second out. The one-two. Swing and a miss. Struck him out on a cutter down and away. Down goes Perez, and Brown gets his first strikeout and retires the side. Singer has a 3.38 ERA this season. That's 10th best in the American League. And now the Astros bat for the first time. Jose Altuve leads off. Sinker, broken back grounder, hit on the ground is short. Bobby Witt Jr.'s got it, throws over to first in time for the out. And the hulking and ever dangerous left handed hitting Jordan Alvarez. Slaps a single into center field. Good start to the homestand for Jordan Alvarez. One out base runner for Alex Bregman. There goes Alvarez, and it's chopped to Garcia just inside the line, and Michael throws him out. Two down with Alvarez at second base. Right handed hitting catcher for the Astros. Sinker bounced softly right back to the mound. Singer's got it. Plants, fires to first in time for the out, and the inning is over. Two gone now in the top of the second inning. Brings up Michael Garcia. Garcia punches it, shallow right center field. Hayward dives and smothers it, no catch. Garcia safe at first with a single. First game as an Astro in Minute Maid Park for Jason Hayward, a five-time gold glover, and he nearly showed the Astros fans why. Garcia, he'll steal. He's got 32, only been caught once. There he goes. Isbell takes down and in, and Michael will be in there, and he picked a really good pitch to run on. He gets great jumps. That's one of the reasons why he's so successful. His success rate is off the charts. 3-2. And that's lifted in the shallow right. Hayward loping in. He's there. Makes the catch and the side is retired. Two out of hit, but nothing more. Ben Gamble's a recent pickup for the Astros, too. They claimed him off waivers from the Mets. Slider swung on and missed. Strike three. That was a biting breaking ball down and in, and Gamble chased it. So Brady Singer's got his first strikeout. Pena chops it to the right side. Massey gets the high hop chest high. Fires to first in time for the out. Two gone. Sinker knee high down the middle. Called strike three. Singleton's back to the dugout looking. Brady Singer strikes out a pair in a one, two, three bottom of the second. That'll bring up Bobby Witt Jr. with two outs just like you like it. Here's the 0-2. In there, strike three. Feathered one right at the bottom of the zone. That was the changeup, and he gets his man. Scoreless after two and a half. Jason Hayward stands in for his first A.B. with this uh, Astros team. And the pitch. And a breaking ball. Bounce to the right side. Brady off the mound to glove it. Underhand toss to Vinny at first for the out. And Hayward is 0 for 1 as a Houston Astro. Two and two in the pitch. And that one is called strike three on the outside corner. The sinker raises. The outside edge, and that is strike at number two on the night for Brady Singer. Three and two on him now. The pitch, and a slider is pulled to third. Nice backhand stop by Garcia, and a throw across to Vinny on the backhand. And Houston goes down in order, and that's eight in a row set down by Brady Singer. It's Paul DeYoung, struck out his last time up. Here's the one two. Got him upstairs. Cheese. Fourth strikeout for Brown would play three and a half at Minute Maid. No score with the Royals and Astros. One and two on Alvarez, the pitch from Brady. And a swing and a liner to right field coming in. Hampson to make the catch. That liner came right to him. Sometimes those could be tricky when they're kind of headed right at you. But Garrett made the play and retired the dangerous Alvarez. And now Alex Bregman, who's now 30 years old. And that is called strike three. Good morning, good afternoon, and good night. He has a couple of words for the home plate umpire as he walks back to the dugout and they toss him. Yeah, Bregman had his back to Tosi. He was walking away when Tosi ran him, but clearly had something he wanted to say to him because after he struck out, he went between Perez, went behind Perez, the catcher, to say something to Tosi as he walked by. That's four strikeouts now for Singer. That'll bring up Yiner Diaz with two away. Two, two, and that is called strike three. On the sinker, Brady Singer, a 1-2-3 fourth inning, and he's retired 11 in a row. Now 
challenge Jeremy Pena. He grounded out his first time up. 1-0. Ground ball left side deep in the hole. Backhanded by Witt. He bobbles on the exchange, and Pena reaches first without a throw. Witt was a couple of steps into the outfield. Would have had a tough time getting Pena. That's likely to be a base hit. As Singer had retired the last 12 in a row. Here's John Singleton. Struck out his first time. 2-1. Cued up the third baseline, just fair, and goes into foul territory. On his way to third is Pena, and down to second goes Singleton with one of the softest hit doubles you will ever see. That ball was literally off the end of his bat, just cued down the third baseline. A beautiful thing. So here we are with action. Jason Hayward with an opportunity in his second A.B. as an Astro. And the infield comes in with one out, 2-0 pitch. That one hit hard down the line. That'll be Extra bases, two runs will score. Hayward into second base. And welcome to Houston, Jason Hayward, a two-run double, and the Astros lead it two to nothing. Jason getting a sinker inside and pulling it down that right field line. The acquisition paying off quick here. Infield in, runners at second and third. The veteran got a pitch he can handle. Alvarez leads from third with two down. Another 2-2 two -two pitch. And a swing and a grounder toward the middle. Bobby to his right, scoops it up. Fires across, inning over. And the leadoff single by Alvarez does not lead to any runs. Here is Salvador Perez. He has struck out. He has grounded to third. Now the 0-1. And a swing, and he taps it toward the middle to his left. Pena has it go through him, and Salvi safe at first base. He couldn't make the play. Looked routine off the bat, but Pena came in and couldn't make the play. Runner goes. Pitch. Inside with a fastball, ball four. So a very good plate appearance. And so first and second now. At the moment, Brown has the edge as his team leads 2 0. He's done pitching change here in Houston. Michael Garcia will now bat. Three and two in the pitch. The runner's going. Ground ball, third base coming in. Whitcomb gets tied up, bobbles, throws, safe at first. He had kind of an in between hop, and he had trouble securing the baseball. But that's perfect base running. It limited Whitcomb, and it keeps the inning alive. Bases loaded, two down. One ball, two strikes on his bell. Now the pitch. And a slider, fly ball, down the left field line. Gamble is on the run. Will he get there? He won't. It drops in fair. Garcia scores. Three runs are in. It's a two-run opposite field double off the bat of Kyle Isbell. And the Royals take a 3-2 lead. Altuve into second base and now two on here in the eighth inning with one out. Uh, Yiner Diaz 0 for his last eight. This one up the middle, barehanded to first base and it's thrown away. Altuve will come in to score and that'll tie the ball game. Unbelievable. Right back up the middle, Ursa got it with the bare hand and the Astros tie it. What an amazing chain of events to get the Astros back in the game. And three balls, two strikes, two outs. Bases loaded in a 3-3 game. Ball four. He walks in the lead run. What a plate appearance for the rookie, Zach Dezenzo. Now Mauricio Dubon is at the plate. Dubon, that's a base hit. This will score two. And the Astros take the lead and extend the lead. A huge hit for Mauricio Dubon. A two-run single, and the Astros lead at 6-3. to three. Here's MJ Melendez. As the Royals down to their final out. To left field, Dubon is there, and the Astros win it. 6-3. to three. Houston taking the first of this four-game series.